to this Wednesday's copycat recipe. Today we are making Panera Bread broccoli cheddar soup. This is my husband's favorite broccoli cheddar soup of all time and I have to say it is also my favorite broccoli cheese soup of all time. I do think it is better than Panera Bread's recipe but that is just me. I hope you guys all enjoy this video. I will have the exact measurements and recipe linked down below in my description box. If you, any of you guys have trouble finding it, just comment down below and I will send that recipe to you directly. But anyways, if you are new here, I'd love to have you over at my channel, so go ahead and subscribe down below the video. But let's get making some broccoli and cheese soup. Here are all the ingredients you guys are gonna need to start on your broccoli cheddar soup. So to begin, I have my salt and pepper to season it with. I have my buttermilk, I have my flour, I have my regular butter, I have my regular milk, and then I have my cup and a half of some chicken broth along with my mild cheddar cheese, my carrots, my white onion, and then my broccoli. This is fresh broccoli and we are just going to start by chopping up all this stuff and then peeling these carrots into a little match sticks. So let's begin. Now that we are finished chopping up all of our vegetables, I'm going to be putting my stick of butter into our large pot right here. If you have a Dutch oven, you could be using your Dutch oven at this point. Now that our butter is nicely melted, I am just going to be adding in our veggies now. So I'm going to be adding in our diced up onion, along with our diced carrots. These are like matchstick size. You could just buy the matchstick size carrots at the grocery store if you prefer that. Lastly, we're just gonna be adding in our chopped up broccoli. And you are just going to stir this around and let these vegetables get softened. Here we have our vegetables, nice and tender finely. This took me about eight to 10 minutes. I did wanna to mention to you guys, I cut my broccoli pieces a little bit thicker. If you don't like thick broccoli in your soups, you could definitely cut them smaller. You could also even puree them and this soup will still turn out great. So now that everything is sauteed together, I am going to be sprinkling in our flour pretty slowly and I'm going to mix this all together until it is well combined. Now that we have our flour incorporated with our vegetables nicely like this, we're going to be adding in our chicken broth along with our heavy cream and lastly our milk. I'm just gonna give this a good stir and then I'm gonna season it with a little bit of some salt and pepper. Now I am just going to mix this together until it starts thickening up. This is probably gonna take about 15 minutes.
Alrighty, our soup is so thick and beautiful right now. So now we're just going to be adding in our two cups of mild cheddar cheese. This is just already grated cheddar cheese. Um, if you grate your own cheddar cheese, it will melt down better, but I just didn't have any of that. So I'm just going to add this in and stir it around for about five minutes just to get this cheese melted and everything warmed through. Our soup is 100% finished, so now let's go plate it up. Here is our soup all plated up. I just served it on top with some more cheese and then some parsley flakes for color. This recipe is so, so good and I really don't think it will disappoint you. Another plus to this recipe is my house is smelling so, so good right now. So this recipe is a total hit for our family. And that wraps up today's coffee cut recipe. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. And if you want to make it yourself, I will have the recipe linked down below in my description box. I hope you guys all have a great week this week. And if you are new here, I'd love to have you over at my channel. So go ahead and subscribe down below the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.